everyone, welcome. This is IER Vibes Info Entertainment Reviews Channel. Lots of love. What's going on in Yellowstone? What is happening? 700 people leaving their ranches, you guys, near Yellowstone Volcano? Let me know down in the comments below. Love to hear what you guys have to say. Really, what is going on? Since the last splurge of earthquakes that struck out in Yellowstone Super Volcano, now recorded well over 400. Is Yellowstone gonna blow? What's happening? Let me know in the comments down below, you guys. Now, here is another major update for you for your latest earthquake seismic in California. 3.9 magnitude, but basically a 4.0 magnitude strikes Truckee, California, just 12 miles northwest of the area. But here's the thing. As I zoomed in, here is where the swarm has broken out, falling by a 3.7 magnitude earthquake just right before what i mean look at this you guys 202 a.m 209 a.m minutes apart you guys a good tremble of earthquakes falling by a 2.9 magnitude earthquake then a 3.0 you guys all three of these earthquakes all well basically the 3.9 was a 4.0 but again still that's over you figure just adding those two earthquakes, that's 12 magnitudes total. And then plus another one. And then the smallest earthquake, which I did catch with the latest update that I brought you guys earlier, which was this one. Well, actually, no, it wasn't. This is just, this is new right now. This one just struck. Before I started to record, I was recording earlier, then I had my device shut down. So I had to reboot. So as of right now, it is currently 3.45 in the morning, Arizona time. There is a mass seismic activity going on in this area, you guys. What's going on? This had just happened as of right now. That is at 3.35 a.m. at California time. Excuse me, I almost said Arizona. Now, Arizona's been getting very, very small quakes here and there uh, we haven't had any for a bit and of course being a native of California thank goodness not living there I am terrified of earthquakes and it's just unbelievable you guys we're right next door to California literally so I mean in worst case scenario people talk about beachfront property I think it'll be more than just beachfront property look at there's a country song Forgot the name of it. Can't remember the singer. Uh, I believe it came out last year. Some of you who love country music, I, I listen to everything. I love my hip hop R&B. I listen to everything, you guys. Reggae, but I do like country. And one of the songs that did come out not too long ago, they were talking about how he was bringing his girlfriend to Tucson, Arizona, along with beachfront property. You know, it's been talked about quite a bit. Some I'm pretty sure you guys know what I'm talking about. Those who do listen to country. 4.0 magnitude earthquake and it's listed as a 3.9 here's another one with that 3.7 and then also the 2.9 magnitude earthquake a 3.0 again excuse me and then at 2.2 but this here just struck you guys at 3:35 a.m california time let me do a quick refresh to see if anything else nothing as of just yet but basically four magnitude earthquakes striking California. Wow. Not too far away from Reno. Now coming up over here, this was in the earlier earthquake update that I brought you guys. And then also not too far away, Geysers, California, which is pretty close to Cal uh, Sacramento. Now you guys got to remember Geysers, California, this is all fracking area. And you can see it clearly from right here where we're zoomed at but as we zoom in closer guys go check it out for yourself pretty amazing uh, but this is all it all this area all fracking baby 
every single bit of it. There's Castle Springs Rock, California as well. If you guys want, let me just zoom in real fast just to show you the massive amount of piping running on through. You know, and mind you, a lot of people who do live in California, and wow, and nobody sees any of this stuff, you guys. So anyhow, I'll let you do the rest. All you got to do is just go zoom on down in Geyser, California. You guys will see what I mean. And this is pretty darn close to the coast. And, of course, along near other small fault lines, if you guys didn't know that as well. That was a 2.0 magnitude earthquake striking that area. Very interesting. But, again, near Reno, California, getting smacked with those earthquakes. Following by what is listed a 3.9. But, you guys, that was a 4.0 magnitude that had struck. 2.1 magnitude, which was yesterday's earthquake. Now, you can see my location here in the blue. That is me. Coming up down here, take a look. Let's see what's going on. Nothing in Guatemala. You guys, surprisingly, very quiet. Nothing going on here. This was as well yesterday's earthquakes that had struck in Argentina and as well Chile. But those of you, if you did not see that video, go check it out. And also, just to update you if you're just coming on in, 4.0 struck yesterday in Argentina, following by the 5.1 magnitude earthquake. And then also coming up over here, 5.3 magnitude striking up in Fiji Islands. And again, this is just going over for those who missed the first earthquake update. If you guys did not get it, well, this is just updating you real quick from yesterday's activity. 5.0 magnitude earthquake following by another 5.0, which struck in Indonesia. And then also... Zoom in on here real quick and take a look at this, another 5.0 magnitude earthquake. Very close to the Philippines. Now, is there going to be a lot more seismic activity within the area? There certainly is indeed, you guys. So for the next few days to come, everyone definitely stay up to date with all of us. Keep an eye out. And also, for those of you who do have software or you do monitor yourself just to kind of keep yourself in the know what's going on, Definitely keep your eyes open because there's going to be a big swarm of quakes to come here in the coming few days. And it could happen possibly sooner. Now, for the next two weeks to come, I know two weeks sounds quite a bit far out. But within the two weeks, we're going to see a lot of big stuff happening within the time frame. So it's going to be very interesting. And, of course, the blue dot, you guys can actually see how close I am to home uh, originally. And that's very, very close. Arizona is not far away from California. And if something was to happen in California, I tell you what, we're going to have more than beachfront property. Um, definitely don't plan to be sitting around if and when that does happen. I tell you what. Uh, 2.5 magnitude striking Hawaii which was just recently, and take a look at this, yesterday's earthquakes again with a good swarm, but, of course, nothing major. These are all within the two magnitudes of range. This one pretty much struck right within the development, and this is Pahala, Hawaii, with a 2.4 right in the heart and not comparable to that 4.5 that Hawaii had recently had. Very interesting and just so much going on, you guys. And also, another thing that I want to bring up. This is some pretty interesting, cool stuff. Now, this is more flat land. So, we have been having a lot of craters impacting Earth and just so much stuff going on. There's already, quote, about a volcano coming in. So, what's going on, you guys? I don't know exactly. I want to keep you updated. And I will continue... To see what is going on. Otherwise, this is pretty much the latest for your earthquake update. And I had to update you guys with that four magnitude. Basically, that's what it is. And other than that, the Afghanistan earthquake that had struck with a 4.2. And then, of course, with what's going on in Greece with that 4.3 magnitude. And that is not the only one, you guys. They had a little bit of a swarm of quakes following by that 4.4. So... Let's keep an eye out, heads up high, feet grounded, love lift smile. This is IR Vibes. I'll see you later on, you guys. Be safe, everybody.